This is another product review on sillyreviews.com. Got an interesting item here. I found this at the dollar store. Uh, for one dollar, this is a marijuana home drug test. It includes one drug test. It's 97% accurate with results showing in five minutes. And it says it's easy to use. Uh, this easy screen looks like it might be the brand name. Let's take a look on the back and see if we can't figure out. It's made in China. Uh, you need to store it between 40 degrees and 85 degrees Fahrenheit. Keep it dry. For in vitro diagnostic use only, do not, do not reuse. Let's see, any more information? Okay, how am I going to do this? Okay, that chart right there on the left shows you uh, positive and negative or invalid results. And, okay, I guess it's kind of like a pregnancy test, which I've done before, where you just kind of dip this thing in there. Let's see, it says a test must be done at room temperature, collect urine in clear cup. Uh, blah 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 take the strip out after three seconds lay it on a flat clean dry non-absorbent surface such as a as the box or pouch that this comes with I guess and uh, read results read results in five minutes important do not read results after more than five minutes that's a pretty damn precise uh, timeline I guess I'm gonna read the results around four three or four minutes so before I take this uh, test, something interesting is the whole, I mean, it's from the dollar store, first of all, and 97% uh, accurate. So let's pretend, let's, uh, let's say I'm 13 years old and, you know, my dad thinks I'm uh, smoking the pot with some friends. He sees us at the dollar store, brings it home, tells me to take it. All right, what if, I, what if I'm in that 3%? If I'm three out of every, you know, hundred kids getting tested with this kit and, you know, it comes up, you know, false positive or something, that's really got to suck. Well, anyway, I don't know how seriously you can take this thing, but I'm going to try it out. So, uh, all right, let's go take a whiz and uh, see if I pass the test. All right, they make it very clear not to go past this max uh, level. So, let's be certain not to do that. Okay, we're gonna put the strip on the packaging it came in, and we're gonna wait. Let's see what happens. I don't, uh, I don't do any drugs, no marijuana for sure. So, should come out negative. Okay, well, the results are in, and it actually only took about 10, 15 seconds for me to, to start seeing uh, the results. If you take a look at this chart, well, let's see if we can get this thing focused in. Okay, positive, you're going to have a strip at the, stripe at the top, nothing at the bottom. Negative, you're going to have a stripe on each of them. And invalid is just going to have the bottom. And mine came out. Hey, negative. So, I mean, I guess that's two thumbs up. I'm not really sure, though, because, you know, it's, it's from a dollar store. Not that everything from the dollar store is bad, but it seems like the, uh, you know, it's a pretty big deal. If, if somebody at your job, your wife, your mom, your dad, your whoever, whoever's being tested, the consequences could be huge if this thing wasn't, you know, very accurate. 97% accuracy doesn't really uh, sit well with me. You know, I want something like 99.999% accuracy. So maybe the 3%, uh, you know, difference is because of human error. That could very well be it. But I'm going to give it two thumbs up because it didn't give me a false positive. So that's good. All right, this has been a review for the marijuana home drug test from Easy Screen, purchased at the Dollar Tree for $1. You watch this review on sillyreviews.com.